okay guys in today we will learn that how we can create a cube on a plane and how we can able to move it so for it first of all you must have to go to the top left corner and here you can see the word hierarchy just under right just under it you can see the word create just click it and you can see a lot of options and also you can see an option for the cube click on the cube and here you have your cube within the main window of unity then again click on create and go to take a plan and now you have plan you have both the cube and the plan but problem is that this plane and this cube is not so much visible because they both have the same color so in order to make them colored we have to select material just click on create and take this material and here is new material go to the top right and here you can see this main color option click on it and here select some color for the cube just click on this material new material drag it and throw it on cube now you can see that cube is visible properly again go to create and take material for this plane do the same go here in main color and select green for the plane okay click on it and drag it on the plane then we have now you can see that we have this cube ready and this plane ready so in order to move this cube you need to write some simple code very very simple code so go here and click on this create and go to ch script and here you can see that we have selected the ch script then go to cube and here you can see that there is inspector for the cube then click on the ch file and drag it and throw it on the inspector and here you can see that it is added okay now we will click it and we will see c hash code uh, you have you, you can see that there is there is some sort of pre-built code or built-in code of the uh, file but we must have some sort of concern with wide update uh, with this function so here you need to write trans form dot translate so what it is actually transform mean when a thing used to change transformation dot translate means it is moving or it was supposed to move linearly like in a line not in a curve or not randomly but in a specific line so now in this built-in command we have to insert some sort of parameters like for xyz for for y we will select zero app yeah and for z we will also select zero f why it is so because we don't want the cube to go on y axis or z axis but for x axis we can select it like 0.1 f and and what what is the meaning of this f actually this f indicates that these values are a float type this is the hard declaration sometimes we use to create like um, double integer long boolean and all these data types in the void start or in under the, this public class or universally just underneath this using system dot collections 
but here we are just declaring and inserting these parameters so now we will go to the build and click on build down and it's built successful then we will go to unity and we will click on this and by pressing play button you can see that our cube is moving properly if you just change the sign like uh, minus 0.1 f so we will see that either it will go in the opposite direction so hopefully it will go in the opposite direction and here you can see it so hopefully you got the concept thanks for watching